Michael Jackson's son Prince is sharing what the king of pop would think about the free Britney movement. While making an appearance on Good Morning Britain, the 24-year-old got candid about Britney Spears' ongoing conservatorship battle and explained why he believes his late father would, quote, wholeheartedly support Britney. Knowing my father and the, the, the compassion that he had for individuals who wanted to remain in control of their own life, um, as it was his goal to be in control of his own life, I would think that he would be very supportive of her. Prince noted that the music icon would also, quote, understand the place she is coming from. And I think he would wholeheartedly support her. Michael and Britney reportedly had a type on before the Billie Jean singer passed away in 2009. Back in 2001, the two even sang The Way You Make Me Feel together in Madison Square Garden in New York City. So it's no surprise Prince believes his father would have supported her efforts to end her conservatorship. During the rare interview, Prince also opened up about his father's lasting legacy and shared that sometimes he still hears MJ's voice while he continues his dad's philanthropic work. When you do philanthropic work, and if you care about it a lot, such as myself and my family, I think it, you tend to carry the weight or the struggles of the people that you're trying to help. And that's really when I hear my father's voice the most. One of Prince's passion projects is his annual Halloween party, Thriller Night, which benefits his nonprofit organization, The Heal Los Angeles Foundation. At the event in 2019, Prince revealed to Access Hollywood how his late father continues to inspire his philanthropic efforts. When people talk about my father, they talk about him as the greatest entertainer of all time. That's where the moniker, the king of pop, came from. But what people don't really realize, and what he's always expressed to me growing up, is he didn't really want to be remembered for the music. He would prefer to have been remembered for his humanitarian work and his philanthropic work. Because even if you listen to almost all of his songs, they're about inspiring love and compassion, as well as inspiring a good time and making you feel happy, because that's the type of person that he was. So for me, continuing on that legacy of philanthropy is, is my calling, it's what I need to do and what I feel uh, I just, it deserves all of my time and attention. And I feel that, you know, my father was such a global icon, and still is, that Heal the World Foundation worked fantastically for him. I'm blessed to have the following that I do, but I feel that I can use, best use my talents within a certain location. And that's why I would like to start within my hometown of LA and then hopefully inspire others to start a Heal Chicago or Heal New York. Or at some point, once we get the following, we will branch out and start working on other places.